Hey guys, John, Common Sense Outdoors. Let's say you've become stranded or lost. You're now in a survival situation. You know the coastline is to your west or you know the freeway is to your north. But you're turned around and you don't know which way is which. How do we find the most accurate method to figure out direction? without a compass. Pretty much everybody knows the sun rises in the east and sets in the west. So it got close to being dark. I realized I'm going to spend my night in the woods. If I also know that I don't have a compass with me, before it got dark there was one more thing that I should have done. And it's getting close to that now since so getting down there pretty good. All I'm going to do is take a rock for a base spot. I'm going to find two sticks the same length and I'm only going to use one of them that night before that sun went down. I'm going to put it against this rock and I'm going to point at the sun with it and I'm going to lay it down. And I'm going to stand behind it and I'm going to look right down the stick and I'm going to make sure that I'm pointing directly at the sun before it went down, right before it went down. I know that's west. The sun went down in the west. I'm pointing at west. <clears throat> in the morning, when the sun comes up, I'm going to take the same length stick, I'm going to put it against the same rock, and I'm going to point it right where the sun came up. If by chance you were worried that maybe a critter would stumble into your setup, you can put in some sticks to make sure your stick doesn't move. Oh, that stayed in good. So now the sun has come up the next morning. And I'm going to do the same thing and I'm going to point it right at where the sun came up. I know that's to the east. I'm going to take the straightest stick I can find and I'm going to lay it across those to where they're just touching the ends. I've just gave myself east to west line. All I have to do now is lay a stick across it the other way. I now have north, south, west, east. Stand to where west is on your left, east is on your right. You'd be facing north. Now, let's say I know the freeway is to my north. I'm not going to have these sticks with me all the way to that freeway. So I need to find something as far off as I can find that's a good marker. A pointy hilltop, a rock formation, whatever I can find off in a distance that there's a good chance I'll be able to see on my way to go there and walk towards that visual reference. There you go guys. That's all I wanted to point out on that. Um, it may, be, may sound too simple to be true but it can't be wrong uh, I don't use compass very rarely have I ever used a compass my brother says I don't need a GPS he says I have JPS John PS uh, and I'm very good with direction and knowing where I am I can leave the truck walk through the woods for five hours, five, six hours, never step in the same place twice, and come back out with inside of that truck. Does that mean I'll never get lost? I hope so, but you never know. So the more you know here, the better you're off 
the better off you're going to be if it does happen. I hope I never have to use this method, but if that day comes and it's almost dark and I'm in the woods somewhere not knowing where I am, right before that sun comes down, I'm going to point a stick at it and in the morning I'm going to know which way's which. And I have all night to think about which way I should be trying to go, which way that road is, which way that river is, which way that coastline is. Something that will get me in the right direction to civilization. Thanks for watching. Like, comment, subscribe. More videos coming to you soon, guys.